Today, we're going to talk about and rate Lucifer the Biscuit Hammer, episode 20. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Well, we just started the world of this anime finale, so keep on watching. Very few animes have uh, started their roots to the finale with a backstory episode. Uh, at least for the first two thirds, I have for yeah for the first uh for the second half of the uh of the episode. It's, it's a backstory. So first order of business, the Tomia. We see Amamiya here uh, almost completing his secret training. We all know his original goal is Amamiya. He wants to destroy the world himself. And to kill every beast knight. <sighs> Looks like he's reached his goal. Alright. You see the smoke coming out of his mouth? <laughs> so with that out of the way, let's get to the nitty gritty of this episode. Race! I know, pero! The pacing picked up when animals created the biscuit hammer. Okay, because So... Wow, they, it, it showed here that they, him and Anima were going at it for, for, for a good hundred years now. I couldn't comprehend. <laughs> but if there's anything the pacing of this episode will tell you, it's this. The backstory, yeah, the, uh, the long backstory sequence is justified. Now we know kung saan nagsimula, kung saan ang origin nila Animus and Anima. So do I have complaints? No, di naman. Um, swak na yung base ng episode. Flow naman. Now first Gushin here is of course, probably the most no-brainer in the episode. Animals created the Biscuit Hammer. It totally dictated the um, the rest of the episode. This uh, this gear shift. I'm not gear shifting. Eh. Right? It's what gear shifts do, guys. Second gear shift was when Asahina met Amamiya for the first time. You can call it a no-brainer kasi nagkaroon na pala sila ng prior contact. Right? Inerase lang ni Anima yung memory ni Amamiya of the, of the entire incident. Mahiwaga ang ang mga parito? ang mga discounting ni Anima. Final gear shift was when, of course, Animus announces when the final battle will be. That's why I call it a gearship, guys. It clearly showed how how psychotic this guy is. So these three gearships that I saw. No, beaten. Do not watch these three gearships alone, guys. Watch the entire episode. Blood lies. Um, it's a no-brainer, guys. Planchado ang plot! It's a well-earned out plot! Obviously! Kasi... Well, after 19 episodes of not explaining the origin of Animus in Anima, eto na tayo. It's probably good timing kasi road to the finale na eh. Um... Nas might as well uh, spill the beans as to, uh, as to the origins of these two. So all are not bad guys, okay? And uh, hindi naman na eh. Uh, the last party sequence was done in good taste. Alright? So, I got the good things. So, pace, flow, and plot. <sighs> we all came together for this episode, folks. Are we going to um, watch the final four episodes of this anime? Oh, hell yeah. So, Lucifer and the Biscuit Hammer, episode 20. Yeah, deserve. Two thumbs up. I know what you're saying. JG, yung mga mga backstory sequence ah. May kung sa akin eh, one top up lang ito. No guys, it's the road to the finale. And, uh, the backstory sequence uh, came at the right time. Kung 
inilabas sila ito sa final 3 episodes yan yeah, I got a problem with that kumbaga ito yung pinaka momentum builder ng anime na to this backstory the origin of animals and anima so yeah it's not a good taste pare so we'll just have to wait for the next episode and while you're at it watch the next review or yeah catch up on the reviews you haven't uh, you haven't seen yet so again Lucifer and the Biscuit Hammer episode 20 two thumbs up